The guiding principle in this edition has been to make it easier to teach from and to learn from. We heard a lot from instructors and students that they really wanted a slightly shorter book. Without making huge, you know, fundamental changes, certainly trying to, to keep its modularity and the ability for, for professors to, to take all the chapters that they've been familiar with so far and, and to rearrange them again in a familiar way, but, but perhaps more streamlined. We took a lot of time and made surgical edits through to each and every chapter of the book. And by doing so, we were able to remove almost 200 pages from the book, while at the same time actually adding new material, like new examples and new emergent applications in electronics, which is so important in a fast-evolving field like electronics. The changes in technology and the rapid reduction in uh, device size have meant that the numbers that we use in the examples and the exercises and the problems have to be all revised. Another very important innovation, which is new to the eighth edition, is the idea of essential problems. We have gone through the problems and selected a subset that's about 35 to 40 percent of the problems at the end of each chapter and designated those as essential problems. This would be then helpful to an instructor who is trying to pick up a set of problems to assign to the, for their students to do. This book's always been great at combining really expressive prose together with some mathematical analysis that can be complex at times. And what the ebook does is it integrates all this material in a way that's going to be for a lot of students easier to use than even a print book. Pop-ups are available just by hovering over references to figures and equations. Tables can be collapsed to preserve the flow of the text or expanded whenever they're needed. Answers to exercises can similarly be hidden so the students can try them out on their own. An important feature of the 8th edition is the inclusion of video. The videos provide instructors with an added tool to aid in their flexible course delivery. By providing links between the textbook material and the videos at the appropriate places, we really hope that it'll be easy for students to bridge the gap between learning and practice. People talk about inverted classrooms, watching videos ahead of time, and, and, and certainly students appreciate having videos. Also available in the enhanced ebook is a set of almost 150 additional end of chapter problems with solutions. They cover nine of the most frequently used chapters of the book. They are presented together with their complete and detailed solutions. They present an important resource for the students as they prepare either to just studying and doing homework problems or studying for exams. Casey Smith was my supervisor in graduate school. He has been my mentor and my friend for over 50 years. He is without a doubt one of the best circuit designers in the world. His most important contributions in the book probably can be found in two places in the new edition. In the ideas that underlie some of the homework problems, some of the end of chapter problems, and in the historical notes that are sprinkled throughout the book. And his passion always is reflected in the book.